I'm Johnny, and this is my North Beach. I just took my mask off. The mask was for Carnaval. It was last Tuesday in Venice. And uh, I'm going to do, in honor of the Venetians and their wonderful Carnavali, Reese ABC, rice and tender little spring peas. Let me show you the ingredients. It's a pretty simple recipe. Onion, unsalted butter, spring peas, beef broth, arborio rice, sea salt, Italian flat leaf parsley, Parmigiano Reggiano. So look at the size of this onion. That's all they had. They're like, they, this onion weighs about nine pounds. I only need two tablespoons. So let me just take a little piece of it off here. And then I'm just gonna go down this way and then across. So we have that. And I might as well, while I'm here, prepare my, uh, my parsley. We're gonna use this to finish. And I just want the leaves. So I'm not gonna go too fine with this because I like this green to show also. So you, you probably wanna have some of your friends or family around when you're uh, taking these peas out of the pot because this is a two pounds of fresh peas. So if you don't have somebody helping, you're gonna be there all freaking day doing, uh, just uh, taking them out of the pot. The downside is that if you got people in the kitchen and they like to fool around a little bit, a lot of times they take these pots and they throw them at me. So you, okay, let's get this on, on uh, high flame. So I've got four tablespoons of uh, unsalted butter. I'm gonna put maybe a couple of tablespoons of onions in here. Just gonna drop those in. And we just wanna saute this a little bit so that the uh, onions become translucent. You got these coated with that butter also. Just gonna give this a uh, sprinkle or two of sea salt. I got lucky because these are really, I think, the first pick of the uh, spring peas in the market. So they're really nice. But what, what, what about if you can't find uh, fresh peas? Can you make this with frozen peas? You can make it with frozen peas. It's not gonna be as good, but it's gonna be a perfectly, uh, perfectly good dish. So, you know, a lot of times things happen in the market. You can't get what I tell you to get. So uh, anytime you, you come up with a substitute or you have a surprise in a recipe you weren't expecting, send it to me, hashtag Johnny Surprise. We should have some fun with that. So add the beef broth. So it's about three and a half cups. You can use chicken broth if you want to. It doesn't have to be beef. So I'm gonna bring this back up to a high. I'm gonna put the top on just for a short time so that it'll help uh, bring the temperature up. I can see the steam coming out of here, so we're probably at a boil. So now's the time to add the rice. It's a cup of uh, Arborio. You wanna use uh, Arborio or one of the other Italian short grain rices. And I just wanna give this a stir to make sure that the rice isn't gonna to stick to the bottom of the pan. Turn this down to a uh, rapid simmer. I'm gonna put the top on and let the rice cook for about eight minutes. See how this is, this is doing. Okay, you can see now some of that rice is starting to give off its rich creaminess. See how the broth has been reduced in volume? I think what I'm gonna to do to finish this off is I'm gonna increase the flame to high so that we can get a better boil going on in here. And I'm gonna leave the cover off. So I think we're uh, just about done. This isn't a risotto. This is gonna be a thick soup. So I shut the heat off. I'm gonna add my parsley now and just let it uh, cook in whatever heat is residual in this pan. And very important off the heat is uh, to add your uh, Parmigiano, your grated Parmigiano. And we're just gonna mix this all in. You're gonna see that the Parmigiano is even gonna make this Reese ABC even more creamy. Here's the Reese BC from Venice. I uh, love my Parmigiana, so let me give it a little sprinkle here. If you wanted to, you could eat this with a fork, but then you're gonna leave the broth behind. I'm gonna taste it this way anyway. Mm. A really simple dish. Thank God spring's arrived. And these are the first spring vegetables I saw down at the Furry Building. Reese BC, you gotta make this one for yourself. Absolutely dishes. Dishes, delicious. Hey!